Good morning, skiers and riders. Sugar Loaf and Carabasset Valley. Hope you're ready for a great day. Enjoying the outdoors. It's time for your weather and trail update brought to you by 45 North. You can find them in the Sugar Loaf Mountain Hotel for some great breakfast this morning, as well as apre and dinner. And you can find this and much more on all your internet devices at WSKITV.com. For today, we'll see partly cloudy skies out there. Should see some peaks of sunshine, but we also should see some scattered showers move through the area. Uh, nothing like a washout or anything so just be prepared out there maybe grab that Gore-Tex if you've got it things seem to stay soft first thing uh or lower down on the mountain and uh firm up top so the groomers were able to get out there and work their magic so get out there and enjoy it saturday uh we're looking at a cloudy sky out there with chances some mixed showers once again throughout the day as temperatures uh fall just a bit 41 to 45 at the base 36 to 40 up towards the summit and it will be breezy as well on saturday sunday it looks like cloudy sky some rain and snow showers once again ending out the weekend with a high of 45 degrees and a low of 36 partly sunny skies for the day on monday and tuesday uh, with the coldest of those days being monday only a high of 32 but things warm up for tuesday april 2nd with a high of 41 uh, degrees out there want to let you know 153 trails of ski and ride on nine lifts getting to those runs 53 trails on the groomers list last night packed powder machine groom surfaces things did uh, stay soft down around the base as i said so should be uh, some great skiing and riding out there snubber sawduster and skidway those three lifts get you going around the base area at 8 30 they uh, move you around the base area. If you just learn to ski or ride, that's where you want to head. And Double Runner East gets going at 8.30 as well. That gets you for uh, some runs down Boardwalk as well as Lower Winter's Way, Lower Narrow Gauge. Also drops you off right at the base of the Skyline Quad, which brings you up to Spillway Crosscut. And that allows you to branch out from the east side to the west side, anywhere you want to go, uh, from the top of Skyline. And Super Quad gets you to a variety of mid-mountain terrain as well. And that'll get you to any lift you need to get to um, or whatnot from the top of the Super Quad. And those get going at 8.30. 9 o'clock this morning, King Pine and Wiffle Tree. Those those are the east side lifts. King Pine higher up on the mountain, more expert terrain. Uh, Wiffle Tree, more intermediate and advanced beginner terrain, but it's a nice fast super quad to lap with the kids. There's some great uh, beginner terrain park over there as well as Moose Alley and Timberline. That's scheduled to get going, winds and weather permitting, at 9 a.m. this morning to get you right up to the second highest mountain in Maine. And you should see some decent views if you're a beginner. You can check out the Timberline Trail, nice easy trail down the back uh, and west side of the mountain. Lower Witcher's Way, Candy Side Landing, Boardwalk, Birches, and Snowbrook all groomed out around the base area. Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, King's Landing, and Hayburner, as well as Narrow Gauge, Sluice, Spillway, Gondola Line, White Nitro, and Wedge were on the groomers list last night. And those uppermost trails uh, seemed to stay firm last night, so the groomers uh, should have come out pretty good. Widowmaker, Ramdown, Hallback, Flume, and Boomogger on the east side. And lower on the east side, Two Hall, Wolf Tree, and Rollway with fresh grooming on them this morning. And over out towards the west side, Scoot and Good Chance got groomed out. And uh, you'll be seeing the Bank Slalom course as you head up the Super Quad today. That event is on Saturday and Sunday. The event happens on Sunday. The practice runs are on Saturday. A great alternative to alpine skiing is uh, the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center. They've got over 60 kilometers groomed down there and open for you. About 45 of that is groomed. Uh, I have to call about the fat biking conditions down there with the warmer temperatures, but also they've got uh, some great snowshoeing too. Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, that's where you'll find us on social media. And we're always at our website, wskitv.com, with our latest uh, latest local four cast updated twice daily our live quad cam as well as tons of videos of things to do to keep you busy each one of those a reason to stay another day know before you go turning guests into locals if you want to get the word out about your business or your event we work great for our sponsors as well as for full video production services are available so give us a call 237-6895 or an email wskitv at wskitv.com